Hello everybody, what's going on? I'm Cecil Siren, and today I'm reviewing Season 2 of Arrow, the first episode, City of Heroes. But before I do that, you have failed this city! And you really have, and I know that. So, let's get on to this. So, um, Oliver's on the island, which I thought it was a flashback, but it turns out he really was on the island. So, Felicity and Diggle... You know, Diggle, what a, well, that's a weird name, so they, they go to see him get him back because his company's about to go under because, well, his mom's in prison, so. And plus they did that, the other company that made that machine that destroyed the, um, Glades. And some people blame the Vigilante or the Hood or whatever, and some don't. So there's a new group called the Hoods, they're going out killing people and saying his line, You failed this city! Killing people and they're doing it in honor of the hood, but it's not what the hood would have done. He didn't kill innocent people, but I don't know if these people were really innocent or not, but there's a lot of action, there's a lot of drama, there's a lot of emotions in this. Thea, once again, hates her mom, this and that, but she's still doing pretty good because she's running the club that Alva made and her boyfriend Roy Harper is working for her and he talks about but she's not too happy about him going out there trying to be a vigilante saving people and all this stuff and then finally they're talking about the vigilante he hasn't been seen in a while and then and then Oliver walks in I'm here and it's kind of weird because it's like yeah he's the vigilante but she doesn't know that of course and neither does um, Roy Harper so he tries talking so about the about going to see their mom and this and that, that doesn't happen. Later on, she'll change her mind because she gets captured by these guys called the Hoods. And finally, the Hood himself has returned, but this time, he will not kill. He doesn't kill anybody. Because he won't, in honor of Tommy Merlin, he will not kill any of these people. Which is pretty cool, he's changed. A lot of the characters are some development. Also, Roy Harper at at the end of the show, he's telling Thea that after she stayed by the hood and he's talking to her on the phone or whatever and he's like, I'm going to get us a burger from Big Belly Burger or something like that. I was hoping Burger Shack, but that's not going to happen. So, he goes to stop these guys that are attacking this girl. And he says three of them. They have, one of them actually knocks him down and then it looks like they're about to hit him again. And then some girl comes out there. So it's beating the hell out of him with those things. It's kind of like what Nightwing uses. And just beats the shit out of him. And we all know. And spoiler alert. If you don't know this. That's Black Canary. But it's not Laurel Lance Black Canary. The rumor is. I'm not going to say who it is. But we already know if you've seen all the clips and pictures and whatever not. But she kicked the ass. So this episode was had a lot of emotion. Thea finally goes see her mom and says, I tried to hate you, but I can't hate you. I, I wanted to, but I don't. And then she's like, if I give you a hug, will they shoot us or whatever? So it doesn't happen. Also, the company is kind of safe because now it's 50-50 because Oliver owns half and this other girl owns half, this angry-looking lady. So yeah, she's no good, but... It looks like Oliver saves the day this time, but he's back, and he also says something about he doesn't want to be called the Hood or the Vigilante anymore, and he holds up an arrow, a green arrow, so that means he's either going to be called Arrow or Green Arrow, so he's no longer a Vigilante, he's a hero now, so this is really good, I'm liking this direction I'll take, and I can see why they took the direction they did on season one, there's only a one or two episodes I didn't really like that much, but for the most part, this is a great show. This is my second favorite show on TV. If you want to know what my first one is, it's The Walking Dead. That's my favorite show. Second favorite would have been Young Justice, but it's done. Thanks to the people of Cartoon Network, you punks. Anyways, that's it for me. Make sure to watch Arrow and um, also Vampire Diaries if you want to. Bam. Have a good day.